guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Grip Doll from Capture Eye Studio. Today's video is going to be on this beautiful eye look. It's really simple, but I thought it would be perfect for Lordi since it's bright around the corner. There's not that much color involved. It's just really smoked out in the outer corners. And I use the Anastasia Beverly Hills Modern Renaissance Palette. So if you want to see how to create this look, please keep on watching. The first thing I'm going to do is grab a fluffy brush like this one and I'm going to start working in a soft brown into my crease. The reason why I'm doing this is because I want my eyes to look bigger and it's going to help create some definition. Then with this shade right here, it's similar to my skin tone and I'm just applying this to the inner third of my eye. This is just going to help my eye look really bright. Then with the brush that comes with the palette, I'm going to take this shade and work it into the outer part of my lid. And I'm also pushing this up into the transition shade that I put into the crease. Underneath the brows, I'm going to be taking this light shade and I am going to make sure that I blend that out as well. Then I'm going to start defining the crease a little bit more. Usually I just focus towards the outer corners, but I'm taking this color really into the inner socket of the eye as well. And I'm just going to load up the brush and apply some product into the outer corner without blending it out. For my liner, I'm going to be using the Lit Liner by Pink Orchid Studio and this liner is really nice because it dries matte and it doesn't move. Just apply your liner as you would. Be very careful with creating lines. If you do mess up your liner, use a Q-tip and you can just redefine it and go back in with some more liner. For my lashes, I'm going to be applying Roller Lash by Benefit. I am also going to be putting on some false lashes, obviously guys, because it's me. And I love these because it makes it look like you have a lot more eyeshadow on and it makes the look a lot more dramatic rather than having to put on such dark shadows. So this really completes the look. For the inner part of my eyes, I'm taking a uh, Inner Rim Brightener by Tarte and this helps brighten the eyes and also makes them look a lot bigger. Then underneath, I'm going to be taking this smudger brush and I'm going to just use those two brown shades in the outer corners. For my jewelry, I'm taking these beautiful earrings by Sohom. They are located in Bio Business Center in Surrey. And I'm going to just pop these on. And at the end of the Sahare, I added some bobby pins. I'm going to just use this as a half up, half down technique. You can also pull out the front of your hair to make it look fuller. And then apply a red bindi. And I also threw on a nose ring because why not? So this is the finished look, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. And thank you guys so much for watching. If you want to check out my previous video where I show you some tips and tricks for when you're getting ready for an Indian party, make sure you click that box right there. And if you want to subscribe to my channel, you'll probably see my face here somewhere. Just go ahead and click on there. And if you want to follow me on my Instagram, my Snapchat and all of that cool stuff, you can check out these links down here. Give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and I'll catch you in my next one. Thanks guys for watching.